interesting, Rio, looking at Real Madrid and, and, and Ronaldo's situation. I know you, you're certainly plenty of good times with, with Cristiano. I, I noticed he's got, a, he's got a book out and I saw the serialisation, a little read through it. It seems, it seems that you guys weren't that kind to him early on, almost, almost bullied him a little bit in training. Is that true? Or? No, but we, we didn't in bully him. In a friendly manner, I'm sure. Yeah, but, but it was just, we all saw the huge potential that he had mm. and he came over and his first thought was to entertain and we wanted to win and we knew that with him in our team if he had end product we had a far better chance of, mm. of being successful so to say the better word we were kicking it out of him yeah. the entertainment factor to get the actual end product the goals and the assists and so that was like a deliberate ploy and you think overall it's probably served him well a hundred percent. It wasn't something that we would have spoke about. It's just something that natural that we would have thought, listen, this guy's got the talent to take us over the line to the next level. And to do that, he's got to start passing the ball. I remember Ruud van Istel almost walked in from training because he was doing mm. the, about 50 step overs and he said, I can't play with this. Yeah. Cross the ball so I can make runs to score goals. A couple of Paul Skulls tackles would have sorted that out. Did exactly. they? <laughs> I don't worry about that. <laughs> <laughs> when he mean. got near him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. To catch him first, yeah. yeah. Um, no, look. Look, it was like every player with talent, you, you need them to work back, you need them to work for the team and if you're going to be a successful team. And he, you know, he didn't really entertain the, the thought of running back, did he, and, and defending. And you have to say that's the way he's brought up and you know, the talent he had, it, it made up for that. We, we didn't care towards the end, really, did we? You, 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 see it straight, you must have seen it straight away. The fact that he was deep, so outstanding, you just thought, "Craggy, what we got here?" We were, we were all in the toilet. Remember, we played against Sporting Lisbon. All in the toilet. Yeah, we, we played against Sporting <laughs> it's a bit Lisbon. Odd. <laughs> half time comes. We played against uh, Sporting Lisbon. Half time comes. We come in. He was like a seventeen-year-old. No one had heard about him. Yeah. Just back off tour. We was all jet lagged, etc. And we're in the toilet going. We've got to sign this guy. And we're looking in the change room and seeing Shazy was marking him. John O'Shea was like this. <laughs> <laughs> he couldn't get, couldn't get near him. Sorry, Shazy. But it was, um, that was the moment you say, well, we have to, by the time we got home, he was signed and still delivered. Yeah.